hey guys welcome to pull it up and so today i'm going to show you how to make ar filters on instagram using spark ar and photoshop it's very easy and simple uh, you just need to have spark ar and photoshop on your pc or laptop and you're ready to go so now you have to head over to your browser and search for any design or uh, you can add your own design uh, if you want and select it um, and or download it from there and i'm just going to go with any of these designs here so i'm just going to go with this texture here and drag and drop it to my desktop or save it by the normal traditional method and then open it with photoshop yes yeah and after that uh, what you have to do now is download the spark ar face assets um, they have already uh, given it in their website and i have given it the link in the description below so you can download it from there and go to the textures in the folder and choose uh, face feminine or face masculine from there i'll just go with the face masculine one and again open it with photoshop now just drag and drop the texture uh, to the face masculine picture and it will look uh, something like this um what we do now is unlock the background and save the layer zero and press okay and select the wand tool from there uh, you'll see that the, uh, that the, it doesn't get selected uh, select on the wand tool again and right click on it and select the magic wand tool from there Yeah. Now save the layer via as copy, and then um, then adjust and then transform the texture as you wish. And you can add more textures if you want. I'll just go with one. Uh, but you can make your own drawings or anything. Uh, just adjust it a bit. After adjusting it, um, you have mainly completed the uh, crucial part, and you're almost good to go. Yeah, so it's done. Um, it's it looks perfect. And uh, so what you have to do now is to, uh, make the background transparent by cl clicking on this I button, and save this image as PNG. And I'll just uh, then name it as Face Mask One. Now head over, head over to the Spark AR website. Uh, the link is already given in description below, and download the app from there. And since I've already downloaded the uh, app, uh, so I'll just head over to the application here. Uh, you'll see that many projects are already given uh, presets, and I'll just go with new project because that's already pre-made. Now just go to the uh, video icon here on the left hand corner and uh, you'll see that the that many um, pre person uh, videos are already present there and you can also use a webcam uh, as your testing uh, just but i'll go with the pre person videos this person's skin tone is similar to me so i'll just go with this one and then choose add object and face mesh from there and you'll see that a face mesh like this appears on your face and it looks more realistic on your uh, webcam but now go to materials and choose just choose the uh, materials option and you'll see that the white mesh appears on your face it changes to white and you can uh, you can change your color but it won't matter um, so almost your filter is ready and just head over to the face mask one that you just created and drag and drop it to the spark ar uh, left panel and you you'll see that it gets copied there under textures 
and just he head over to the uh, materials and under textures uh, you will see that the face mask one is ready to be applied yeah so now you see that the magic happens and your filter is ready uh, you can test it on other preset persons or on your, yourself of course this person looks yeah nice yeah so your filter is ready and you can again uh, one more tip now you can go to the materials and go uh, from there select retouching and from there um, select skin uh, retouching and you can see that uh, you can um, just apply beauty effects to your face uh, this is just a f filter effect so that's a nice add-on also uh, you can test this on your uh, device i'll just show you this in a moment but before that if you see any abnormalities just press on no compression so that nothing happens and then just go over to the test on device icon uh, in the left hand corner and you can directly test uh, send it to the app instagram or app or facebook camera or uh, connect your device um, by plugging it to your PC or laptop and now you are done and you can just export or upload it um, to the Instagram Spark AI Studio that's it for now guys um, I'll show how to make the color filters in my next video uh, so stay tuned and uh, hit that subscribe button and also that like button these are the examples of some other filters, AR filters. And if you have any questions regarding this, uh, you can just uh, ask me in the comment section below and I, uh, I'll answer to all of them. So you have seen how simple it is. So make your own filter guys.